Hi, it's Doug Coy for SoWhatDoYouThink.com. Well, I don't know if you watched the series Mad Men or not, but I uh, watched the uh, final of that the other night. Wow. You know, it's hard for me to believe that people actually live and act like that, but I guess they do. And, uh, you know, the old story, you know, money and power creates a lot of problems. However, I thought to myself, I wonder if aliens who were doing a report on the world that we live in, Earth, uh, if they were doing a report and all they had to go by was television shows, movies, things like, um, you know, Borat and stuff like that. Uh, you know, they saw, say, CNN and Fox News and the political coverage. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I wonder what kind of report that they would give on planet Earth. I'm sure they'd come up with something like, hmm, no intelligent species on planet Earth. But... What do you think? I'm going to talk to some people here on Granville, and uh, I guess it's Hast not Hastings, Granville and Georgia Street, right in the heart of Vancouver, and we'll see what they have to say. Well, who knows, man? Maybe like you know, Jerry Seinfeld said, like the aliens probably think we're uh, the dogs or the uh, are the the overlords, and we you know we pick up after them and we treat them real nice, and uh, so who knows, right? And uh, but yeah, if they go by television, uh, ooh, I I don't know, maybe. Maybe we don't have uh, too much good in store for us, you know. <laughs> and by Mad Men, you know, we're all a bunch of uh, drunken uh, <laughs> adulterers <laughs> or whatnot, yeah. Probably that we're all um, workaholics, maybe. Workaholics? <laughs> that we value fame and looks and that we, um, I don't know, pay a lot of attention to drama, I guess. Yeah. I mean, if that was the shows that they were basing us on, if that's all that they knew, I think that those shows kind of portray um, a stereotypical business person's maybe vain way of looking at life. And I know that's kind of blunt, but that's probably yeah, no, what I no, think it would good. be. Yeah. Very poor impression. Very poor impression. Yes. What? Uh, can you elaborate a little bit? Well, the media doesn't tell all of the truth, just one side. Oh, generally. come on now. It's just like now. <laughs> <laughs> that can't be true. <laughs> yes, it is. I mean, with things like Fox News, I mean, you know, there are, CNN's not biased. Yeah. There's a lot of good things, but they generally hit one side of it. Yeah. They have a pretty uh, one-sided opinion of what's going on. You think it would be, in some ways, they say that media reflects society. Do you believe that's true? No. I think they're feeding society information they want to give. I think planet Earth is beautiful. It's, you know, our television is good, our internet is good. You can get everything you want on the internet and television. If I want to watch something, I get everything. Okay, so there you have it. A uh, lot of people, some pretty good, uh, pretty good discussion points there. My own personal opinion, I think if they came down and saw movies like Borat or uh, the current one, Dictator, or if they saw some of our uh, TV shows like Mad Men or, oh, well, you could name so many, I think they'd probably conclude that, no, there is no intelligent life on planet Earth. If they watch the presidential election process on television, I am absolutely convinced they would say there is no intelligent life on Earth. So there you have it. There's a Doug Coy, but as usual, so what do you think?